Hey there everyone, it's Ghost here. Uh, I've noticed in my streams that a lot of people don't know what they need to do to complete their weekly assignment to get an exotic the easy way. Now, as you know, on your weekly assignments, well you probably know, on your weekly assignments you have various objectives to achieve. So if I move down to the weekly assignment here, this week it's eliminate 50 Rikers. Well, I just nip in the dark zone and clear out 50 Rikers um, around here. I do it over here at the refueling station. I clear the Rikers from Bryant Park and from Arch Plaza. And then I'll nip back to a checkpoint over here, get myself some more ammo, maybe kill a few enemies around here and then come back and rinse and repeat and it doesn't take me more than half an hour to get that done less usually to get that done that's 50 rikers but that one can change from week to week uh it's a different different thing for each week now this week also it's been 30 tools collected well those you just do outside the dark zone there's various places on your map you're going to find tools just fast travel to the nearest place for example there's two places near amherst apartment this week um 30 contaminated items extracted, well obviously you've got to do that in the dark zone, you've got no choice, but it doesn't matter what it is, purples, anything, so just open every box you find, fill yourself up, go somewhere quiet for an extraction if you're on your own, um, for example DZ4 extraction is a good one for that over here, that one is generally not heavily in use, you've got the cleaners just here beside it, which gives you quite a few uh, bits, there's two boxes in there, plus a a DZ chest if you have a key, plus the boss will drop stuff and various other things you can collect around uh, just to get to get the things you need to extract. Extract here, generally you won't be bothered. I don't find that much hassle extracting at that extraction. And uh, then the last thing you've got to do is 10 main missions. Complete 10 main missions on hard or challenging difficulty. Now this is one thing I've noticed, a lot of people have come into my streams and they don't know the easy way to do this, so that's why I'm putting this little video together. What you want to do to complete your 10 main missions on hard or challenging difficulty is, I'm going to nip back into the safe house here because I'm going to change world tier. Now if you don't know how to do that, it's an easy thing, I'm just going to go to my map and at the top you can see you hold Y to change tier. I'm in tier 5 at the moment and I'm going to change up to tier 1. Hit confirm and I'm now in world tier 1. So now if I fast travel over to Amherst apartment uh, this is the quickest and easiest way to get your 10 main missions done. Super fast in fact. You can run this mission in 3 minutes and 20 seconds. Now, it really doesn't matter what build you're using, but one thing I do do when I'm running this is I will put a turret on, fire turret, and in my talents I will go and put wildfire on. Okay, so I have wildfire on. Uh, I don't care about any extra damage or anything. I'm not worried about my other talents. It really doesn't matter. Set the mission to hard. So set it up as hard and then just run it like this you don't really need to kill very much at all these first guys like the ignore them we need to investigate the run straight past them you got no need suspect? to kill them as you come through into the second area just kill three enemies all you need is these three kills and then the big boss will come out of this door down here and you don't even need to worry about him just run past him straight through up these stairs and again you're just going to ignore the enemies what I'm going to do is run past this first one and then I'm going to dump a fire turret just here to keep these from bothering me too much. Climb up here, climb up here, we'll run up the fire escape. 
Even pull out abandoned. my pistol just for that going. little bit of extra speed. Department is upstairs. If Amherst is the author of the virus, he I'm gonna blow my fire turret evidence. up. People like that don't destroy the proof of what they've done. Up into Amherst's actual apartment, have where you have around. to open up over the chest, there probably wasn't looking for the bag, or, and if you get lucky or the and box. Find there, Today, this mission, so I can ask if <coughs> it's the bag. So we you collect the evidence, out no. the window, there's an ammo box well, there should you need it, but you probably won't. I hope you found what we're looking for. If you get through all your ammo running, running this ten times, I would be very surprised. Have to the rooftop before it can touch down. Straight up on the fire. roof. Get the evidence back here safely. Down the hole. Yeah, right down this hole. Keep it up, Agent. We need that rooftop cleared so we I'm can pull flip the back evidence to my gun now, cut through the doorway here. Now this is the only place you really, apart from the three enemies in the second area. It's the only place you need to kill enemies. But as you're on tier 1, they are super easy. They're level 30s. And you're used to facing in World Tier 5 level 34s. Now I'm going to just nip up here and drop my fire turret. Come out here and kill these two. Sometimes an axe guy will follow you through from the last area. And my fire turret is up there destroying them. Any that make it through and jump down, you can just kill them off. The helicopter's coming in. Drop down in here. Stick the evidence on the rope to extract. Kill the one enemy that comes out this door. It's a yellow. And then kill the two bosses. You can either wait here for them or you can jump up there. You can even chuck your fire turret out if you want. But you won't need it. They're so easy to kill on level 30. All the stuff they'll drop will be level 163. Look. Okay, so you're probably not going to want that. You'll just get rid of it. For example, look. That shotgun's just been put in my inventory. It's a level 163. Well, why do I want that? I don't. I'm just going to deconstruct that. Or you can sell it. So, that's it. Run through one time. Then you go back to your map. Move to the beginning of the mission. And just hit replay mission. Okay, so it's super fast, super easy. Change to World Tier 1 on your map. Run Amherst Apartment over and over again. And it will take you 35 minutes to run this mission 10 times. No more. I'm going to do it one more time. Just to make sure you got the idea. Don't bother killing anything. Why? Why bother? I mean, let's face it, running 10 missions on Hard or Challenging is a pain in the butt. It's time-consuming, annoying. So instead of actually doing the missions, just bypass it all and save yourself some time. They haven't burned the place down yet, thank God. I'd love to talk to one of these cleaners sometime. It actually takes longer to extract 30 items from the Dark Zone. Than it does to complete 10 main missions on hard if you do it this way. The only annoying thing about doing it this way is that you have to listen to Fei Lao talking non stop. She does not shut up. We'll send someone out to round up any survivors and get them back here safely. You're clearing the path for them, so just keep going. She has an awful lot to say during this mission. The apartment is upstairs. If Amherst is the author of the virus, he must have left some evidence. People like that don't destroy the proof of what they've done. Have a look around. It might have been looted, but whoever was in there probably this wasn't time in the chest of drawers. Or hard drives. If you get lucky and find Amherst there. Uh, the evidence will so change place from you. mission to mission. We won't get that. But it lucky. will be one of those three we places every time. Well, I can dream. I hope you found what we're looking for. It's high priority, so I routed an extraction chopper for you. But you'll have to secure the rooftop before it can touch down. 
Don't play with fire. Get the evidence back here safely. Keep it up, agent. We need that rooftop cleared so we can pull the evidence out. And at the end of it, you will have a big pile of stuff sat there. From the dark zone only, pulling out but it'll all be low level, none of it you want. For the current off, we'll make an exception. You see your fire turrets up there doing all the work for you. There comes the extraction chopper. As soon as the chopper's in, you put your evidence on. One yellow enemy in there. Two bosses up there. There's one, and oh dear, look, there's the other. And that's the mission completed again. Three minutes, 23 seconds. I know we took civilian losses, but there would have been a lot more if you hadn't been there. Excellent work, Agent. And don't forget, once you're done, once you've finished doing it for those many times, you go back to your map, hold Y, and switch back to Tier 5. So you can get your level 256 gear for everything you do outside the Dark Zone and inside the Dark Zone. So uh, there you go, that's the best way to run 10 main missions on hard or challenging. Just run them on hard on Amherst Apartment on Tier 1 and it will take you about 35 minutes to complete them all. Hey guys, that's a very short little video for you. I hope you enjoyed that and I hope it's helpful to some of you that didn't already know it. Because I get quite a few of you asking in my streams, you know, um, what I'm doing and why I'm doing it the way I'm doing it. But well, that's exactly why. It's super quick, super fast. And it's boring running those 10 missions. I really don't enjoy doing it. You know, I, I'll i run my legendaries and incursions each week. But it's I only get the missions for the legendaries. Um, otherwise, I don't really want to be running the missions, to be honest. I want to be in the dark zone or I want to be farming for exotics. So, uh, yeah, there you go. That's all there is to it. Enjoy. Take it easy, guys. I'll see you in the next one.